Humanoid robots are damn interesting. They can amaze everyone, from children to adults. Also, robotic technology is expanding in such a way that the 21st century is constantly witnessing some incredible creations in this field. There is an unannounced tech race in many countries, and certainly, India enlisted its name in the competition. There is no doubt that India is getting global attention very often with its extraordinary innovations regarding the development of robotics. In this video, we'll be taking a look at some extraordinary robots that have been made in India. Hey everyone, welcome to AI Future. Live, a perfect channel for everything about the innovation in AI. Hit the like and subscribe button and don't forget to press the bell icon to never miss an update from us. Humanoid robots are a type of professional service robot that is still relatively young. They've long been a pipe dream, but they're finally starting to become commercially viable in a variety of applications. India, as a rapidly developing country, has also left its mark on the robotic sector. With a global market share of around 15%, India is an emerging prospective market for industrial robotics. A wide range of robotics Activities can be enabled with the right stimulation and investment in the main underlying technology. In India, in the field of robotics, a variety of persons, institutes, and businesses are involved. So let's have a look at the list where we are going to introduce to you some female humanoid robots that give India a very well-recognized position in the robotics field. Because of the extended period of the pandemic, wearing a mask when going outside has become ingrained in our daily lives. When we enter a public location, our body temperature is measured, and drops of sanitizer are given to our palms. But what would be your first reaction if the person you mistook for a lady in a store turned out to be a humanoid female robot enforcing COVID-19's safety guidelines? A robot named Zafira is being employed at all of a company's textile stores in Tiruchirappalli, Tamil Nadu, to guarantee that COVID-19 safety rules are followed. The sari-clad robot scans everyone entering the store for masks, checks their temperature, and dispenses hand sanitizer. She's also keeping track of how many people are entering the business to avoid crowding. Talking about the initial aim to develop this robot, let's hear the words of the CEO of Propeller Technologies. Mr. A. Rahman, he said, We've developed robots ever since COVID-19 broke out and the lockdown was imposed to help frontline workers. The robot has a complete intelligence system. It can also track the number of people entering the store at a time and send details to owners via email daily. Mr. Rahman claims that the team is concentrating on mass production because they have received bulk orders from several stores in Tamil Nadu and Kerala. It starts working as soon as the customer enters the store. It will first check the client's body temperature. If the temperature is normal, it will now check whether or not the person is wearing a mask. Finally, it will drop hand sanitizer on the palm before allowing the individual in. The next one is a unique creation, with a typical Indian look and a next door name, Shalu. And what made it so unique is, this robot is actually made from waste materials. Many scholars compare it with the Western humanoid robot, Sophia. Kudos to brainchild of IIT Bombay's Kendriya Vidyale computer science teacher, Dinesh Patel, whose robot prototype, Shalu, is getting global recognition. According to Shalu's creator, Dinesh Patel, the Shalu humanoid robot is the only one of its kind in India, and it is created entirely of recycled plastic, cardboard, wood and aluminium parts. According to Dinesh Patel, the Shalu robot concept came to him after Prime Minister Narendra Modi's Digital India mission inspired him. He further mentioned that the Shalu human robot, which was created in India, cost only 50,000 rupees. In a post, he also revealed that the Shalu robot took three years to develop into its current form. In a school setting, Shalu can be employed as a robot teacher. This is because Shalu can administer tests, respond to queries on GK topics, and solve maths problems and equations. Shalu has a wide range of abilities, including the ability to recognize and remember people's faces, as well as identify familiar items using computer vision. As India has a diverse culture with many languages, the humanoid robots developed on Indian soil should have the ability to speak in several languages, right? Well, Shalu has. In addition to English, the Shalu robot can hold a casual conversation in as many as nine Indian languages, Hindi, Bhojpuri, Marathi, Bangla, Gujarati, Tamil, Telugu, Malayalam, and Nepali. The robot is being used to teach the 6th grade students at a school. Shalu also talks about the government's instructions about keeping a safe distance and wearing a mask for safety during the COVID-19 days. Listen to the robot and do wear a mask properly for you and your dear ones' safety. Heard about a robot that is a radio jockey? Hold on as we are going to introduce to all of you the RJ humanoid robot, Rashmi. On December 3rd, 2018, the robot conducted an Ask Rashmi program on Red FM where it answered listeners' questions from 10 a.m. to 11 a.m. Robot Rashmi hosted a show with RJ Raunak, aka Bawa, 
And in the evenings, from 5 to 6 p.m., she hosted another show with RJ Kisner and Ashish. Additionally, in preparation for India's first human space trip, Gangayan, in 2022, the Indian Space Research Organization approached the robot's developer to inquire about employing it in unmanned missions. Two ISRO experts met with Mr. Srivastav to see if the robot could be improved with simulated human physiology quality. Developed by Ranjit Srivastav, a programmer from Ranchi, this robot with lip-synced speech ability can move its neck in six directions and make facial expressions. It can make 83 different facial expressions. Also, Rashmi is multilingual. She can speak English, Hindi, Marathi and Bhojpuri. Rashmi interprets conversational emotions using speech recognition, APIs and AI. It has a camera incorporated into the eyes that provide facial recognition, 3D mapping and OCR capabilities. The robot also has a working hand that moves its fingers. With this, our next robot is a female space-friendly robot. This lady robot gets the pass to space from ISRO. The the Indian Space Research Organization. In one sense, this robot will be the first Indian woman to travel to the International Space Station. The humanoid robot lacks legs and can only move side to side and forward. She is Vyamitra. The Indian Space Research Organization will deploy Vyamitra, a woman robot, aboard the unmanned Gangayan spacecraft before taking people on India's first manned voyage to space. In the first session of the human space flight and exploration, present challenges and future trends, the robot was the center of attention. When Vyamitra, a mix of the Sanskrit words Vyoma, which means space, and Mitra, which means friend, presented herself to the audience, everyone was taken aback. It said, Hello everyone, I am Vyamitra, the prototype of the half-humanoid been made for the first unmanned Gangayan mission. I can monitor through module parameters, alert you and perform life support operations. I can perform activities like switch panel operations. Amazing, right? The half-humanoid would do all the human duties in space and interact with the environment control life support system, according to former ISRO chairman K. Sivan. He continued, It will be simulating exactly the human functions there in space. It will check whether the system is right. This will be very useful to simulate as if a human is flying. Further, Dr. Dayal Dev claims that she can detect and issue warnings if environmental changes within the cabin become uncomfortable for astronauts and make changes in the air conditioning system. She can adopt postures that are appropriate for launch as well as accept command. To sum up here, the last but not least is a doctor's assistant, Bharti. The governor of Chhattisgarh has inaugurated a robot called Bharti to aid doctors and COVID-19 patients in hospitals. Aditya, a young engineer from Pillai Institute of Technology, led the team that created Bharti. The robot was constructed in under 45 days and is designed to reduce doctors' virus exposure. The robot's particular characteristic of ultraviolet radiation disinfects the surface of doors, handles and other objects. Even they use the robot to communicate with patients, encouraging them to maintain a cheerful attitude during their treatment. Well, this brings us to the end of our video for today. Please leave a comment below with your opinions on these amazing Indian robots on our list. That's it for the day, guys. Don't forget to press the like button and also subscribe to our channel. And hit the bell button so that you'll be alerted the next time we post a new video. We'll see you at the next one. Until then, peace.